Hello everyone, welcome to the training of DeepGus Software Learning. This time, we will learn the function of QR code. How do we achieve QR code like this? I will introduce it from two parts, software setting and practical demonstration. The first is the software setup part. We need to open the T5L DGUS 2 application development guide, and you might ask where you can download it. You could search for this link in your browser, and then turn to the QR code section. We will use SP to adjust the size of QR code today. This is the offset of SP03 represents SP plus 03, which is used to control unit pixels. Next, we need to master some DGUS control parameter settings. This is the QR code display control. We need to use the SP address and set it to 1000. This is the VP address, 1000 FFFF is available for the user to set, so we set it to 1100. Unit pixels set to 4. Display mode here is the default setting. Here are the show and hide settings, we need to use the return key code control. Select the pre-designed button effect image. About key settings. 0x00 equals hide, 0x01 equals show. Select its VP address 1100. Then there are narrow and enlarge functions. We need to use incremental adjustment. Select the button effect. SP plus 0x03 is used to control unit pixels, so set it to 1003. Adjust the way according to the function, narrow the QR code to choose minus, enlarge the QR code to choose plus. The over limit operation selects stop mode. The pixels we are going to adjust are divided into 7 levels, with step length set to 1, lower speed to 1, and upper speed to 7. Finally, the function of change QR code. Select incremental adjustment. VP address 1100 and select in byte. Adjustment mode selection plus. The over limit operation selects cycle mode. The QR code is divided into 10 different shapes. Each adjustment will change the distribution of pixels, with step length set to 10, lower speed to 1, and upper speed to 100. Now, please join me in doing this. Let's open DGUS and go through the actual steps. First, click New. And set the resolution to match that of your screen. Then set the file path and click OK. Click the plus sign and select the background image. The image needs to be named from 00, 00 onwards. Next we need to generate 32 to ICL background image. Click Welcome, then click Dwin ICL Generator. Select the image directory. And finally, click Generate. Name it 32 to ICL file. Click Touch and Display Config. Select QR code under the graph show. Box select the display area. The parameter settings section is the same as I described before. We need to use SP address. 1000 to FFFF are available for users. Let's set it to 1000. VP address cannot conflict with SP. So set it to 1100. Unit pixels set to 4. Display mode here is the default setting. Here are the show and hide settings, we need to use the return key code control. Select the pre-designed button effect image. About key value. 0x01 equals show. Select its VP address 1100. And then copy it again. Change the key value. 0x00 equals hide. Then there are narrow and enlarge functions. 
We need to use incremental adjustment. Select the button effect. SP plus 0x03 is used to control unit pixels, so set it to 1003. Adjust the way according to the function, narrow the QR code to choose minus. The over limit operation selects stop mode. The pixels we are going to adjust are divided into 7 levels, with step length set to 1, lower limit to 1, and upper limit to 7. Then copy it again. And change the adjust method to plus. Finally, the function of change QR code. Select incremental adjustment. Set VP address to 1100. Adjust method selects plus. The over limit operation selects cycle mode. The QR code is divided into 10 different shapes. Each adjustment will change the distribution of pixels, with step length set to 10, lower limit to 1, and upper limit to 100. Finally, generate the file and click Save. Copy the Dwin set folder to the SD card for burning. And we can get the QR code project. Next, insert the SD card into the slot. And power up the screen. Burn the project to the screen. Blue screen showing end indicates that burning is complete. Then power off. Remove the SD card. And power on again. We can see the QR code display box. Hide QR code. Reduce QR code. Enlarge QR code. Change QR code. Thanks for watching.